Hey guys, VGI here. Um, today is a little bit of recipe video because I just thought I should be doing this. Uh, basically in South India, most people don't prefer to have bread, butter or cheese or jam in the morning. You know, that combination never works out because they feel it weird. I don't know, they just feel it weird holding it and eating it and then they just don't feel like they just had a breakfast. So I'm going to show you how to make bread upma or bread upit in the Canada style. It's just a combination, it's just like you just season it, that is pretty much it. If you make that, they're just cool because it becomes slightly South Indian and it's easy to eat and it's quick. That's what they want. They don't want to hold on to something and act like as if they didn't eat it. Yeah. So let's get into the video. Got the bread uh, cut into these sized pieces, two centimeter by two centimeter, and about the standard thickness of it. Then we have uh, mustard seeds for seasoning. Then it's what known as a black gram. Uh, it's got a black coating outside but when you actually chop it off it's actually like a slightly creamish kind of uh, uh, protein kind of thing we call it pura dal some chilies uh, some uh, this is curry leaves then some turmeric powder for uh, flavoring and coloration and then we have yogurt with asafoetida mixed in it this comes as a solid cake you gotta just uh, basically just you know, crush it and then put it onto the curds. Basically, what this thing does is kind of like forms a uh, what do you say? This is a noodle. Yeah, yeah. This was a noodle. Somebody ate that. I'm not really sure too. And then, so basically, what happens is when you have the curds, it, it, it forms a layering on the bread so that all this is sort of like form a coating, which which brings in the flavor. Let's just get on to the video. And you can add salt or sugar according to your taste. It's, it's your preference. So that's pretty much kind of like ready. I'm gonna start with, you see, for me it was a coconut butter. Can you see that? It's just so hard. It's like, I don't know, it's like, it's like, uh, I don't know what to say. It's like, look at that. Um, falls like a uh, key, you know? Look at that really like hardened up so I'm gonna, I'm gonna just put half a teaspoon of oil you don't need too much for this yeah let's get liquid eye I'm gonna slowly put the peanut doesn't matter it doesn't have to be hot and I'm gonna actually bring the stir to the I'm going to bring the stout to the sim right now so that overcook and then try to over fry it on the inside. It's going to go like that until it becomes uh, a little darker in its coloration. Yep, there it is. Okay, now I'm going to just add the mustard seed. You can see I'm gonna add the mustard. After you add this, it's gonna make a weird, uh, well, splattering. Then I'm gonna add the curry leaves. It's gonna make a weird, uh, well, splattering sound. Just listen to that. Until it starts doing. Then I'm gonna add the curry leaves. That cheese. Then uh, the black gram I'm gonna just continue mixing up until the uh, black gram actually gets slightly you know comes into a golden brown color you need to keep everything ready because if you're not ready with everything you're gonna just, it's, it's just difficult because the whole house will become 
a mess with the smell. The smell is so pungent when you start frying it. The smell just goes way beyond the bearable capacity of the thing, you know. So it's become golden brown. Don't try to weigh too much on this one because the moment it reaches the golden brown color, it just snaps into that color. I'm gonna add the when it reaches the golden brown color, it just snaps into that color. I'm gonna add the turmeric. I'm gonna mix up that. Okay, do that. Now I'm gonna add the bread crumbs. Bread pieces, not crumbs. I'm gonna add the bread pieces. Oh, come on. That is pretty much it. Now, after do that, I'm gonna add this. The yogurt with the asafoetida. I've, I've dissolved the asafoetida in it. It's very easy. You can get powder or the cake, as I showed you. The cake is more, uh, let's just say, more effective when it comes to this. It kind of gives the flavoring and then it, it helps you in uh, better uh, what do you say? digestion of the system, which is impressive with that. Again, yeah, now it's kind of like mixed up, I think. Now, to keep this all together in one place. Oh, come on. Now we're gonna add this. I'm just gonna just go like that. Just drop that like that. Now, to keep this all together in one place. Oh, come on. Now we're gonna add this. I'm just gonna just go like that. Just drop that like that and just mix it up and we're gonna add this because this had the asafoetida I'm gonna add like that and just go again and do that's all if you want, you since it's got asafoetida, asafoetida is very effective, so you can just do this. Most South Indians do this stuff. You know? Just like the bread will just that's it. Any Indian would actually love this because it's been seasoned. Y'all season everything, everything, whatever is possible. Just season it, season it, season it, season it. I don't know. That's the kind of style here, and we love it. We love seasoning things. Easy to eat, easy to eat, easy to eat. That is pretty much it. There's just one more thing I just forgot to add. That was salt and sugar. That's pretty much it. Hey, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, give a big thumbs up if you did like the video, and do. Comment below if you did try it out, you know, and if you want any kind of like assists more, do comment below and uh, let me know if you want to see these videos, these kind of videos. I could just do it. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys.